Find the missing terms using the common difference. Today's lesson I will discuss how to find the missing terms using the common difference. Example number 1. The given arithmetic sequence is 2, 8, and 3 missing terms. To find the missing terms, we will use the common difference. How to get the common difference? It is just simply subtracting the two consecutive terms of the arithmetic sequence. It is good that there are two terms which is consecutive, the 2 and 8, unless it makes difficult for us to find the common difference. In subtracting make sure that the greater value will be the first to write followed by the lower value to get the right common difference. Just like this. So, we have d is equal to 8 minus 2 is equal to 6. Therefore, the common difference is 6. Next, now we will find the missing terms of the given arithmetic sequence using the common difference. As you can see the value of the terms or direction of the arithmetic sequence is increasing. Therefore, we will add the common difference to get the next term and the other term. Let us start with 8. 8 plus 6 is equal to 14, then, 14 plus 6 is equal to 20 and lastly to complete the sequence 20 plus 6 is equal to 26. Therefore, the arithmetic sequence is 2, 8, 14, 20, and 26. May we have example number 2. The given arithmetic sequence has 3 missing terms and the available terms is 6 and 9. To find the missing terms, we will use the common difference. How to get the common difference? It is just simply subtracting the two consecutive terms of the sequence. It is good that there are two terms which is consecutive, the 6 and 9, unless it makes difficult for us to find the common difference. In subtracting make sure that the greater value will be the first to write followed by the lower value to get the right common difference. Just like this. So, we have d is equal to 9 minus 6 is equal to 3. Therefore, the common difference is 3. Next. Now we will find the missing terms of the given arithmetic sequence, using the common difference. As you can see the value of the terms or direction of the arithmetic sequence is decreasing therefore, we will subtract the common difference to get the missing terms. Let us start with 6. 6 minus 3 is equal to 3, then, 3 minus 3 is equal to 0 and lastly to complete the sequence 0 minus 3 is equal to negative 3. Therefore, the arithmetic sequence is negative 3, 0, 3, 6, and 9. Notice that, in finding the missing terms of an arithmetic sequence, if it is towards to the right direction, the common difference will be added, and if it is towards to the left direction, the common difference will be subtracted. May we have example number 3. The given arithmetic sequence has three missing terms and the available terms are negative 5 and negative 2. To find the missing term, we will use the common difference. How to get the common difference? It is just simply subtracting the two consecutive terms of an arithmetic sequence. It is good that there are two terms which is consecutive, the negative 5 and negative 2, unless it makes difficult for us to find the common difference. In subtracting make sure that the greater value will be the first to write followed by the lower value to get the right common difference. So, we have d is equal to negative 2 minus negative 5. Then, it is equal to negative 2, negative multiply to negative 5, it becomes positive 5. Then, it is equal to negative 2 plus 5 is 3. How? As you can see, they different in sign therefore, it will proceed to subtraction and the sign of the answer will be depend on the higher value. Since 5 is greater than 2 therefore the sign of the answer will be positive. Therefore, the common difference is 3. Next, now we will find the missing terms of the given sequence using the common difference. Remember the rule that I gave in the previous example if we find missing term to write we will add the common difference, 
and if we find missing term to the left we will subtract the common difference. Let us begin to find the terms to the right. So, we have negative 2 plus 3 is equal to 1, then next term, 1 plus 3 is equal to 4. We already done in the right. Let us move now to the left. So, we will subtract the common difference. Negative 5 minus 3 is equal to negative 8, therefore, the arithmetic sequence is negative 8, negative 5, negative 2, 1, and 4. Let us have the last example. Example number 4. The given arithmetic sequence has a 3 missing term and 2 available term. The two available terms are 0 and 2. Let us proceed in getting the common difference. So, we have d is equal to 2 minus 0 is equal to 2. Therefore, the common difference is 2. Let us move now in finding the missing term of the arithmetic sequence. Let us begin to the right of the sequence. We have 2 plus 2 is equal to 4. We already done in the right. Let us move on to the left. So, we have 0 minus negative 2 is equal to negative 2, then next term, negative 2 minus 2 is equal to negative 4. Therefore, the arithmetic sequence is negative 4, negative 2, 0, 2, and 4. For more videos on mathematics, please don't forget to subscribe.